numbers are what we have to analyze our weaknesses. They should be broken down completely. Um, so you want to start there. You know, this alcohol percentage and food percentage. Uh, does it make sense based upon the numbers that you're giving? You know what I'm saying? Um, you know, then we want to look at, okay, what was our top sellers this week? What isn't selling on the menu? You want to do that with the food and the alcohol. But then you want to go into the numbers, you know, the staff numbers, okay? How many servers do you have? How many bartenders do you have? How many cooks do you have? What's going on with the management team? Where are we there? You know what I'm saying? Is everybody getting their certain amount of hours in? You know, are we overstaffed? Are we understaffed? And then the next piece we want to go into is the marketing. You know, is it working? What's being done? We never want to roll out new, new, new things without any type of marketing. You know what I mean? Like he should have already had him doing the flyers and all of that shit before we even started lunch. Banner should have been up before we started lunch. Otherwise, it is a waste of money on the company to have these lights on during these hours, to bring staff on during these hours with zero marketing. What do we think people were gonna do? Magically, now that we back more lunch? Come on now. Like we're so much better and smarter than that. We have to get on top of this stuff. You wanna address marketing. Do you want to address social media next? Are we seeing everything that we need from social media? If the girl is not in the meeting, Call her immediately after both meetings and go over everything to her. Make sure it's posted today. You know what I mean? Lunch been going on for two weeks. Why are we just not realizing she ain't been posted about lunch? You know what I'm saying? Come on, that should have been, been realized. Then you want to go through maintenance. Um, go through the maintenance issues. What's being done, what's not being done. You want to start taking maybe about 30 minutes of your day to go over new maintenance stuff. I meant to bring you this book that was sent to my house of like a, just a bunch of Fulton County contractors and stuff like that, but I'll get that to you. Uh, but a lot of times what I do to get them, I go on like the next door app. Okay. You know, you'll see people in there, you know. I would have a good with the people, the list that you said. Okay. You know, I might have, it's kind of redundant. I yeah. might go down the whole list, but yeah. somebody else. Yeah, and then, you know, kind of ask them, hey, you know, you got like a little carpenter, you know, you need a little small odds and ends. And I appreciate that, you know, you're willing to do, you know, some of the hard work and stuff like that. But see, why you doing that, suddenly we can pay somebody $200 to do one of these jams. You know what I mean? That only you can, you know, be on top of to see payroll and bring up payroll. You know, is it any payroll issues? So then we'll kind of go through that. Um, I'm gonna kind of start helping us stream pay line, payroll more since we only got two spots now, you know. So we'll kind of talk about that in the next couple weeks, you know, some ideas and stuff. I gotta first find out what exactly all of the problems are and then we'll, you know, we'll talk about that. Then we'll go through security and safety. You know, where are we with that? You know, are there any issues there? Um, any budget issues, you know, can we scale back? You know what I mean? While well, sales are down, you know, can we scale back? You know, we're paying a whole lot of money in security downtown. We'll talk about that later though. Then you want to go around and do a round, a round robin with, um, you know, your management team and everybody that's at the meeting. Get them a chance, see you know, if they have anything that they want to say, anything that they want to add to the meeting. Um, anything that you've been seeing in, in your pop-ups that maybe you haven't addressed, you know, then you go ahead and address all that stuff then. So, you know, the things that you see, of course, you know, that are media issues, you're going to address them right then and there, you know, with the GMs and stuff when you go in. But sometimes, you know, like, like for example, a lot of times, like if I kind of come out at night and I'm drinking and stuff, you know, and let's say I see, you know, 10 different things, I don't want to get on y'all nerves, you know what I mean? And start putting a bunch of stuff in, in group me. So sometimes if I think about it, I may put one or two things, two things in there. And then I'll just put the rest in my notes and generally I write an email or something like that, you know, so... Uh, but since we're back doing managers meetings, we can do all of that stuff, you know, confront that head on one. Um, consistency, you know, between the menus and the, and the happy hours and the specials. Make sure we're doing that, you know what I'm saying? The food, you know, how's the food been looking? You know, how's it been coming out? Um, what, what is our waste like, you know? What are we doing to make sure we decrease that? And then I think at that point, I think we've basically kind of had everything covered. Okay. Uh, there might be some things that you want to add to it. Um, you know, as you kind of continue to do them and lead them, um, you'll come up with some different things and add to them, you know, and we'll kind of go from there. But that's pretty much um, how you should run your manager's meetings. So before you leave, the next thing that I want you to do is go around, look at magnets, go ahead and write it down. You'll send me a list of that because within two weeks, I need to start seeing some inside magnets improvement, okay. you know, because I'm not seeing 
hardly anything, you know, that we worked on improving. But yeah, I think, you know, most of our maintenance issues here are kind of like around the baseboards and the, you know, the, the blue paint, but you know, go, go ahead, go around, get your list together. And, you know, we got to start nipping this stuff in the bud because these are things I've been talking about for the past couple of months, you know, and I'm just not seeing that. Definitely seeing some things improve, but you know, that marketing, you know what I mean? And so I'm, I'm definitely looking forward to hear some follow-up on, you know, why Quincy wasn't here, what we're going to do about that. Um, in the meantime, we know what needs to be done. Maybe Taz can kind of help lead that with the girls, you know, and helping them, you know, I know Lawrence, you know, with his flyers and have to take a week to take a month. You know, so, you know, we may need to Prima is who prints the flyers, you know, so just move forward, have them printed. Um, let's get out here. The banner, have fast signs or custom signs do it, and let's get it That's up, you know what I'm saying? Because which call it, you know, she gonna take forever. We need this banner out before come next Monday. Well, I'll see you at two. Appreciate okay, it. Okay, boss.